He's coming. Oh crap, there's another one. This is where it starts getting creepers. Welcome to Ivory. It is a game in which it takes some inspiration from Windows 95. It has a UI dedicated to that. And I believe it is also a mystery type horror-ish game. Let's wake up. And it is free to play. Just dial up. We got sanity and stamina. So it is definitely some horror mixed in with this. F and there's that freaking um it's not quite Windows to uh Windows XP with the uh that uh that paper clip that talked to you a bit. But we got the star here. Howdy Ali, don't worry, I'll explain everything. You just been awoken from cry sleep. Now first and foremost, let's head to the AI core room so I can run a system chat. Let's do that. That system check on the way. Hopefully we're going right. It's a flashlight. This is your inventory. Everything you find on the station will appear. Press tab to toggle the inventory. Yes. Please be mindful to not just take things really nilly though. Stealing is still illegal here. Yeah. Besides the flashlight, I'm sure if anything in here will really help. Ali. Okay. Investigating incoming asteroids to the maintenance supervisors responsible for the station's upkeep. All The captain once told me that the lounge is meant to be a good place to hang out. Humanity as a whole. The position of Erinese 43 near the edge of the galaxy allows for Wait, there's more to say. Hope you don't mind me keeping the television off whenever you're on YouTube. I keep it off because redirecting all of my attention to you has become my top priority. Fine with me. What are we doing? I know it's unnerving, but silence isn't an immediate sign of danger. Please disregard concern for the emptiness. At this time, going through maintenance protocol and ensuring your safety are top priority. Your position as supervisor still means maintenance protocol is your priority, but the station is also still open to you. Please be safe navigating the crossroads and going wherever you decide to go. We were just exploring the station. This is the war room. The captain liked to use this place to call important meetings. I think she made a good choice. It's very professional. Entry four. Roman's gone and no progress has been made. Found an entry. And they're voiced. Sam said he was telling me to rest, 
and every time I close my eyes, all I see is Roman farther and farther away from me, just barely out of reach. I'd ask why they couldn't have just listened to me. Not just Roman, but all of them, but I'm not really a commander. The title has no power, and I haven't been one for a while. It's just me and Samson now, after all. At least he'll be here. Hopefully. Signing out. That's it. Unfortunately, this room doesn't have much use when it's just us two here. Of course, we could always hold a conference, even if I can't physically sit with you. Get out of here. This is the AI core of the station security and management space assistant, AKA me, Samsa. You could call this my room on the station. So welcome to my room, Molly. My core is the station security and management space assistant will still persist no matter what. Oh, I mean that in a re reassuring way, Ollie. So long as my systems are functional, I'm here to help you. Due to my safety protocol, I can't reconnect to the station systems automatically. This will have to be manually done by you, Ollie. Please reconnect me to the station to run a full maintenance check. Let's do it, shall we? My computer. Uh, what are we doing? So we gotta get the dots to look like this, I guess. So there we go. Retry. Success. Connection online. Commencing diagnostics checks. Vital systems are stable. However, it seems that the communication system is still down. You have to reboot that manually. Okay. I guess we got to find what that is. Go back through the war room. Please be sure to keep things tidy in the commander's office here. The captain is very particular when it comes to her space. Well, I don't think she's here to judge that. Try not to idle too much, Ollie. We've got things to do. The communication system is still down and needs to be reestablished. Hey, Jay. It's Maisie. New audio it's log. Me. Be mindful walking around here, Ollie, before it might be slippery. Any damages to the water treatment would also be detrimental to the station. Don't worry, I've been monitoring the water treatment while you're walking around. No issues have arisen yet, though still watch your step for any puddles. All the space station's information such as Aaron's 43's conception is located here in data storage. Though if you're really curious about something, you can ask me, of course. Unfortunately, I can't guarantee access to all this information on Aaron's Aries 43 you may be looking for. However, I will always be a source of insight for you throughout the station. Anything else interesting in here? No. Ah, uh, this room. The station's communication system is currently unable to connect to Ivory HQ. Please use the computer terminal to recalibrate the system and try to get it back online. The station's communication system is currently unable to connect. Okay, you told me. Let's do it. I'm but sorry. I'm the system is audio wrong. And it knows, it knows I've forgotten the ideal 
do. It looks like the communication terminal requires recalibration. Failure to establish connection. So we gotta get it to look like this. Who knew, who knew a game like this would have puzzles like this? But it looks like we got it. Easy peasy. This issue is one I can't fix internally. The lab laboratory might have some tools useful for this kind of situation. Right, let's go to the lab. Doors are being locked. Hmm. Sorry, Ali, some doors have been have to be kept locked for you per my safety protocol. Please be careful in the laboratory, Ollie. What's inside here may be well beyond what you're used to for general maintenance. What's situated here in the lab is the haptic oracle preservation and eradication device. Dr. Ferguson called it the hope device, but names aside, please be careful around it. Guess we go upstairs to deal with it. Another audio log. Captain's log, entry three. Virgil didn't come back after the last split. At first, we thought he was caught up in working on the device. So we waited. And waited. And waited. Until and wait. came. Until the hope device needs to be disconnected to from the computer before ourselves. you can remove it. Save Please may you di disconnect it. There aren't many Let's go do that. Like Oh, wait. Virgil was never leaving the project here. unfinished like this. I had yes. no I was right, or he should have listened, comments to say. There's no one okay. to say them to, and even if Virgil came back somehow, I don't know if I could reprimand him. I thought that it would be different, but just like Petra, Samson couldn't find him anywhere on Iron S43. Hey, Roman. Oops. Just calling to congratulate you. Oh, wow. that you're uh, saving lives in space of all places. Anyone's asking though, I totally knew you'd be doing that since you spent all the time locked in your room studying and whatnot. I'll be the first to tell you I'm more proud than anyone else. Well, you know, not as much as mom and dad, but you get the point. Oh, actually, there's something important I need to tell you. Try to live a little, will you? You worry too much for someone who's got a good heart. You'll make a difference out there. I know you will. Anyway, love you. How about we're not gonna do that? Let's do this puzzle. We want two there. Oh, we did it. Great. You can now go retrieve the hope device. I'm surprised these puzzles aren't too difficult. Yay. The whole device should help in reestablishing communication, but we still need the second half of it. Commander Grant's law is mentioned in the security room, so maybe we'll find a lead on it there. Where's the whole device? Oh, we got this right there. That's our inventory. Captain's log, entry three. Virgil didn't come back after the last split. At first, we thought he was caught up in working on the device. Okay. I still wonder what the sanity meter is about. Nothing to affect that came up yet. 
maybe that happens now. This is the security office. The monitors show the cameras keeping watch around the station. Normally they wouldn't let you in there, but this place falls under your jurisdiction for now. There's something you're looking for in these monitors. I can keep an eye out too. I assure you that such monitoring is only out of caution and not necess necessity. I don't believe you. But the music's starting to get more into it. For a new puzzle. So we can't do that with the Oracle process blocking us. Virgil says there's a way to stop it. This hope device he calls it. I told him that we can't just exterminate DNC or one. The way he sees it, destroying it is the only way. I got careless. I should have been paying attention. I I was so caught up in the argument that I didn't notice Petra leaving a note about investigating the station. We did it. I everywhere for her. I checked every place she could I'm not going to do it yet until she finishes talking. I even had Samson search the station for her, but he didn't find anything other than her last known location. It's like she just completely vanished. But Petra wouldn't do that. Virgil won't even look me in the eyes anymore. Or maybe it's the other way around? He keeps going off on his own, hardly sticking around for a room with three things for him to eat. I know he's working on it. All right, and complete. This is the other part of the hope device. Let's reassemble it and head into the Oracle's box. Oracle's box, whatever that is. Say that like I know where it is. Oh, what's this? Run, run. Oh, that's where the sanity meter comes in. Okay. He's coming. Oh crap. There's another one. This is where it starts getting creepers. And they walk around too. Walk in quotes. I guess this is the Oracle's box. Could it be the door that you wouldn't let open? Yep, it is. The Oracle's box. I'm unable to use certain words, but I assure you, I'm just notifying you to be cautious per my safety protocol. The Oracle's box is a wondrous discovery for Ivory. The captain might have called it beautiful herself. Uh, okay. Yeah, I don't believe it. You could very well be radic redacted in this place, Ali. Oh, my apologies. The redacted is a result of my inappropriate language censorship algorithm. I'm unable to use certain words, but the one I use is very bad, not good. Ali, I mean it. You could very well be redacted. Yep, I know. Let's do it. What's happening is that the anomaly created by the Oracle's box is being rectified by the Hope device. Have you yourself as a product of that anomaly as a result of the occurrences you have experienced? Your current reality cannot coexist with that of present Ollie, so it is being erased. But it's okay, you're not dying. Or at least the real you isn't. I don't mean to diminish your accomplishments. You've come so far. And in accordance with the ideals of Ivory, I am incapable of forgetting the beauty and ephemerality. Is this not what it means? To be composed of past selves that no longer exist for a present or even future you. I think it's beautiful. Isn't it beautiful, Ollie? Is it? I don't know. Do they really want us to quit? That's the copyright stuff. 
But then there's the quit button over there. That's all we can do. I hit it. It's not doing anything. Are we stuck? I hope not. I'm going to call that a victory. We used the hope device. But was hope it's lost? Was hope lost? I don't know. Well, this is where we're going to call it then. That's our victory. That's been ivory. It's been interesting. I would have liked for it to have some voiceovers. Because that is a lot of reading. But at least the uh, audio logs were voiced. So that's something. We missed about, I think we had five out of the, no, we had six out of the nine that were in the game. Missed three of them. Still, that's a decent number. Ivory.